Hello, this is Brittany at New Key Real Team. We are over at 122 La Vista in Waynesville in the summit. So they are building houses. This house was only finished uh, the end of last year. So they still had to put some infrastructure in. The grass is, is coming up and grass does grow here fairly well. So still plenty of new builds going on over there. You will have a little bit of building noise. The immediate surrounding houses are finished. Oh, okay. And I do like the colors that were selected. Um, there is a fence. Uh, this house is a three bedroom, or sorry, four bedroom, three bathroom. Total square footage is 2270. Lot size is 0.77, which is actually a little bit larger than the typical lots over here. So there are some big doggos downstairs. Um, we won't go too far into that room, but we will peek into it. And it is a new build. It has been lived in for a little bit, so there is a little bit of wall damage. Doggos did scratch a little bit on the doors. But I think the floor choices, the colors are quite modern. I really like this builder's fixtures and finishes. So very pretty, pretty sure this is granite. You have your stainless appliances. And there is an overhang here, so could have some bar seating. And this would be your more typical dining area. They have it kind of set up as a you know, secondary family room. You have pantry in here. Laundry, so a fairly good laundry room. And then this goes out to the garage. So two car, oversized, you have your attic access up there. You are gonna be on public utilities. In this community, you have your electric, electric furnace, electric hot water heater. I really like the wall and ceiling, more so the ceiling texture. I almost call it like, like a zebra texture. Have bedroom one. This is front facing and it's a, a good size room. And since it is so new, I probably can get a hold of the floor plans for you guys. We do have lots of storage, nice deep storage in here. Another hall closet. The guest bath, it's a good size. You have your tub shower combo, this matching vanity, and then quite a bit of storage over here. There is some damage on this door, which I think this is just a typical, I don't think this is like a super special door. I'm pretty sure we could get a, ask for a replacement and have it painted. A 
covered back deck with the fan and the lights. And then yeah, good size, good size yard. Again, they have dogs, which is probably delaying their grass growing. You can kind of see the path that the dogs like to run. Uh, it does have a fence or a gate. I mean, siding is in great condition. This house is, is less than a year old. <laughs> There's dogs everywhere. Everywhere. All right, the more traditional living room. Does have a little bit of a vaulted ceiling. More storage. And then the master. The master is quite large. So this is a king size bed and there is plenty of room in here. Got a chair, nightstands on both sides and I mean very, very comfortable walking space. I like the barn door and these are actually, let's see, not that one, extra lights down there. I think that is so cool. So double sinks, double mirrors. It's a fancy shower head. I can't remember what this material is called, but they do put this in a lot of their new builds. It's supposed to be very low maintenance, um, very high durability, and just really easy to care for. And then quite a large walk-in closet. So tray ceiling, um, this bedroom does back to or face the backyard. And that is upstairs. There's lots of little touches like in ceiling lighting all over the place. I really like the lights on the stairs as well. Yeah, doggos hear us. So they're in here. We'll pop in here. This is mainly just unfinished storage. <laughs> you have your furnace and your water heater. And it goes over around the corner too, but we're not gonna we're not gonna aggravate the doggies too much. So secondary family living space downstairs. I mean, decently tall ceilings. As you can see the top of the doors and it still goes up. I would say that's, what, 14 inches above the door frames. So, good size. This bedroom faces the backyard. I don't have a light on. I mean, they don't have blinds. But, I mean, it's very light in here. You, you don't have, like, the basement feel. Downstairs bathroom has your tub shower combo. I mean, it is in great condition. Let's see, a little bit of wall imperfections where they had stuff hanging. That's probably where they had another shower curtain. Again, we have our matching vanity tops, matching cabinets. The modern fixtures. Oh, 
hallway towel closet. As you can see, it's nice and deep. They have their vacuum in there. And then the last bedroom. This is a good size. The last one was probably the smallest of any of the rooms. Good size, we're facing the backyard. And good size closets. Again, they're nice bright light coming through, natural sunlight. We will lights and ceiling lights all over the place down here. Let's take a peek at the backyard on the ground level. And that's it. So concrete pad. Again, the deck is, is new. Nice big post. Uh, this is probably six by six post. All right, that is 122 La Vista. I'll get this uploaded. Let me know if you have any questions.